amigos, match day number eight in the 2018-2019 La Liga season is just around the corner. Hold on tight, folks. Here come my predictions. Let's try, folks, back once again with another match prediction video, this time looking forward to match day number eight in the 2018-2019 La Liga season. Now, before we get into the thick of things, if you're new to the channel, smash the old subscribe button to keep bang up to date with all things La Liga related, Blackburn Rovers related, world football related. We've got it all here under one roof. Now, before we get into match day number eight, we're going to take a look back at match day number seven. See how I got on last week. Uh, with my predictions for that match day. So let's take a look back at last weekend's action before we look ahead to this weekend's fixtures. Now, Real Vallecano took on Espanyol. In the end, it was a 2-2 draw, but I predicted a 2-0 away win for Espanyol, so I got that one absolutely wrong. And once again, I've got uh, the La Liga football fixtures absolutely uh, all over the place. I've got one correct, uh, overall correct, two bang-on results. Um, so pretty much... Pretty poor overall. Anyway, Real Sociedad took on Valencia. I predicted a 2-2 draw. In the end, it was a 1-0 away win for Valencia to give themselves some valuable points as they start to climb uh, the old La Liga table. Uh, now, moving forward to an, a bit of a shocker on this one. Uh, Barcelona took on uh, Atletico Bilbao. And I, I predicted a home win here, 3-1 in the end. But in fact, it was a point split down the middle, one all to give Bilbao a valuable point as they are struggling at the moment. And Barcelona choking a little bit at the top of the table. Now, Ibar took on Sevilla. Now, this is the only score I got absolutely spot on and it was a 3-1 away win for Sevilla who again doing all right towards the top end of the table now Real Madrid again good opportunity for them to close the gap up against uh, Barcelona but in fact they took on their bitter rivals Atletico Madrid now I predicted a 2-2 draw here but in the end it resulted in a nil-nil so again got correct result on that one incorrect scoreline now Huesca took on Girona I predicted a 2-0 away win here for Girona who started off life this season in decent shape in the old uh, in the old La Liga, but now things are starting to you know nip away at them. Uh, but in the end, it was a 1-1 draw, so points split down the middle. Now, Villarreal took on Valladolid in the Battle of the Vs. I predicted a 2-1 home win for Villarreal. But in fact, Valladolid got a valuable 1-0 uh, away win to give themselves a good old boost towards the middle of the table. Now, Levante took on Alaves. Alaves were doing so well, uh, flying high in about sixth spot. I predicted a away win here, 2-1 in the end for Alaves. But in fact, Levante picked up a monster win for themselves to give them three valuable points at the towards the bottom of the table. Now, Real Betis took on Leganes. And again, Betis... Uh, doing all right this season. Uh, I predicted a home win here, 2-0 in the end. But in fact, it was just a 1-0. So, got correct result, incorrect score. And now, wrapping up the weekend, on some Monday uh, football, Celta Vigo took on Getafe. I predicted a home win here for Celta Vigo. But in fact, points split right down the middle. 1-1, one, one, valuable point for Getafe as well as Celta Vigo. Now, kicking off forward to this weekend's action, Atletico Bilbao will take on Real Sociedad. Now, I've opted for a comfortable 2-0 uh, home win here. Uh, Bilbao will use their superior home advantage up against uh, Real, Real Sociedad. And it's sort of mid-bottom uh, of the table clash there because Sociedad are in 13th, Bilbao are in 15th. Now, Girona will take on Ibar. Girona are in 11th, Ibar are in 17th. So you would fancy the home team, and that's what I've gone and done. 2-1 win for Girona in the end. Now, Getafe will take on Levante. Getafe are flying high in ninth spot. Levante not doing too well, 16th spot. But I think they've turned a little bit of a corner. So I think it's going to be 1-1 in the end. Points split right down the middle. Alaves will take on second place Real Madrid. Uh, now, Alaves have done amazing to be where they are right now. Sixth spot at the table. But it's going to become, um, this one's a game too far for them. They're going to lose against Real Madrid. 3-0 in the end. So, valuable win for Real Madrid. Can they close the gap on Barcelona, who have a cracking match with uh, against Valencia this weekend? So, we'll see that in just a second. Leganes will take on Vela. Uh, Real Vallecano and Laganas are bottom of the table with just four points. Uh, Real Vallecano are in 18th spot, so it's a bit old struggles here. But I see this as a home win to give Laganas their only their second win of the season, should that come through now. And Valladolid will take on Huesca. Valladolid are flying in 10th spot. Huesca are in 19th, so... Uh, Bit of a struggle here, but I still I still see them getting an away point here. 1-1, one, one, sorry, 2-2 two, two in the end. Point split right down the middle. Now, Atletico Madrid will take on Betis. Atletico Madrid are flying high in fourth. Now, Real Betis are doing uh, pretty well themselves. They're in fifth, so it's uh, a, bit of a bit of a tasty one, this one. But I see Atletico Madrid coming out on top. 2-0 win with the home advantage. Now, Espanyol will take on Villarreal. Espanyol doing all right in seventh spot. Villarreal not too far behind. Where are they at in the old table? Uh, they're in 12th spot, so I think there's only three points that separate the two sides. Um, but I see this as a, an away win here, a bit of a surprise here. 3-1 away win for Villarreal, you know, because my predictions are so whack uh, and they never seem to get any of them right. I'm going, I'm going a little bit of a left field with this one with Villarreal with the away win. Now Sevilla will take on Celta Vigo. Sevilla are flying high in third. Celta Vigo are in eighth. 
for me, 2-1 home win for Sevilla. Now, that is that is form right now. So, Sevilla should come home with the, with the win here. Now, wrap it up. Valencia up against Barcelona. My, my head says... Uh, Barcelona, my heart says draw, but I've gone with my head on this one. 3-1, away win for Barcelona to get themselves back on track after two or three sloppy results. That's pretty much all I've got for you today, folks. If you've enjoyed this video, please give it a good old thumbs up. And if you're new to the channel, smash the old subscribe button to keep you bang up to date with all things Blackburn Rovers related, La Liga related, world football related. We've got it all here under one roof. Also, check out the old link, uh, the old description. Links to my other social media platforms are in there, Twitter, Facebook, it is all in there. Also, let me hear your thoughts and opinions about this weekend's action. What do you think is going to happen? Drop me old, your old predictions in the old comment section below. We can have a good old chat about it back and forth. You and me, like the good old days. Anyway, until next time, which will be next weekend, I hope. Or is it the international break? Hmm, it might be the old international break. But anyway, until I see you again, thumbs up, subscribe. Ciao for now. Thanks again for watching. Please like, share, and most importantly, hit the subscribe button to keep you bang up to date. All things Blackburn Rovers related, championship related, football related. We've got it all covered right under one roof. And while I still have you, please be sure to check out some of the old videos scattered along here. I hope. <laughs>